Come take a look at this Avalanche 29 foot rear kitchen. It's a nicely equipped trailer at a manageable size. It's not a huge beast to tow. Just under 11,000 pounds dry weight. Two slides, both on the driver's side, no slides on the awning slide. So it's a smaller unit for sure, but with the rear kitchen layout, it still feels like a nice open trailer, good amount of size, and it has all the luxuries of the big units like the two air conditioning units, solar is on the roof, auto leveling, hydraulic six point leveling. It's got everything that the bigger Al Avalanche and Alpines have from Keystone. All the nice touches inside, like the fireplace, your massage, heated theater seating, your soft closed cabinet doors. It's got all that in a smaller package. So let's take a look around. You've got the LED lit nose cone, your mirror for easier pin hookup, the road armor, rubber block, rotating head pin for easier towing. Same hitch there is what the big units have that are three or four thousand pounds heavier. Three year structural warranty, complete one year warranty. There's your hydraulic tank for your hydraulic levelers. The battery disconnect, your solar disconnect. Got the big front storage meant for a generator if you choose to go that route auto level controls are tucked inside here turn on the power hit the auto level and you're good to go two 30 pound propane tanks both on one side the other side holds your batteries there's your pass through front storage a smaller lid on this side because of the docking station and the tanks the big access door is on the far side, but this still gets you access to some of the smaller things you might store on this side. There's your all-in-one docking station. So feed up your hoses, wires up through this lid there, close the hatch, lock it up, and it's all in there. Your black tank, your gray tank, dumping valves. This is an all-season trailer, so it does have the 12-volt heating on it as well. And with those dumping valves inside a compartment, heated compartment here, it does make it much easier to do your tasks in the winter. Outside cold, hot shower or spray port, your gray tank, your black tank, your low point drains, your fill controls, your tank flush, along with your satellite hookups, all nice and handy in one spot. It's prepped for the side cameras, so if you choose to go the side camera, backup camera route, simply pop out these black blobs there, and the camera takes its place. Here's your living room slide. Taking a look up top, you can see your Air 360 wine guard dish and your satellite and air conditionings front and back for your bedroom and living room, or actually in this case, kitchen area. Got the rear ladder, has the rear hitch for a bike rack, or you can tow with it. It has a four pin plug there as well for towing a little trailer or boat trailer behind it. And there you've got the awning side. So a nice clean side of trailer here with no slides on the awning side. Get a better look here with no slide in the way, you can get a better look. At the six point hydraulic piston cylinders there in front and behind the tires got the aluminum rims on the eight bolt hubs you have the road armor equalizer there as well for a more solid towing experience the rubber torsion equalizer fold away stairway four step stairway easily get into the trailer you can see the polar pack so that means the extra insulation along with that 12 volt heating cables for the pads You've got the solar flex that is already installed on the roof, so it's ready for off-grid camping, complete with two lithium batteries that come along with this trailer as well. And there you've got the lithium battery stack. So it really is a great unit for off-grid camping. If you need more solar panels, you can easily plug them in there. Taking a step inside. You walk into your living room area, nice open feel, like I said, the way it's laid out here on this 29 foot floor plan, it is still a very 
spacious trailer lots of big windows really helps with that TV on the televator there pops up behind the fireplace gives you windows on both sides and a big kitchen counter in the back with windows three windows at the kitchen counter now that's a spot you can picture doing dishes double bowl sink two windows plus a side window to catch that breeze really no reason to be overheating when doing dishes got the 60 40 split there with the big bowl stainless sink for doing the washing the smaller bowl to do the rinsing and it is a spray hose faucet there as well lots of kitchen cabinet space four drawers all the way down huge under sink storage to do whatever you want with plus you got the garbage can slide out remember I said soft closed cabinet doors it's just like the big units like residential kitchen cabinets magnetic shut just swing the door and wait while it closes very nice doors nice big wide convection microwave glass top stove three burner stove top LED lit knobs glass door oven because this is designed and meant for off-grid camping if so choose it is a four-door propane and electric fridge and freezer no all-electric only fridge in this unit giving it a big two-door freezer two-door fridge run on both propane and electric nice little fireplace there across from the theater seating you can set it for flames only like it is set now or use it to heat up your living room area change your colors blue orange pink whatever you prefer and the big screen TV of course is included as well that pops up stereo and sound bar are up above Kickback seating is under seating LED lighting and the controls for heat and massage. Four padded chairs, storage under the chairs. There is storage in under the table as well. And this is the extend a leaf folded back if you don't need a table quite as long. Fold it forward if you want a little bit more elbow room. nice buffet along the end wall there lots of counter space receptacles and loads of storage it's amazing how much storage they've tucked into a 29 foot floor plan and amazingly it doesn't hit the fan So again, an overview of the kitchen and living room area there before we head up the store stairs to the bedroom and bathroom area. Stair railing up the steps we go. Control panel is right here, nice inside the door, nice and handy. The battery heat is your heating pads for your tanks if you're doing off-season camping your ceiling fan control, your awning control, your slide outs for both the bedroom slide out and the living room slide out, your main lighting, gas and electric hot water heater, and your tank indicators. Ensuite washroom accessible from both the hallway and the bedroom. Porcelain bowl sink, or sorry, don't use that for a sink please porcelain bowl toilet for easier cleaning there is your sink it is actually porcelain uh, no I don't think we better call that porcelain it's a nice smooth finish I think it would be easy to clean but it does feel a little plastic glass door shower skylight big mirror door medicine cabinet 
And what everybody looks for, towel storage. Yes, if you roll them up a little bit, you do have towel storage there all the way down. Pop into the bedroom. We're back out the door and go in the main doorway. Nice big walk around king bed and tables on both sides with receptacles, lighting and windows at the head of the bed. There's your second AC. Nice big front closet and it is prepped for the washer and dryer. Big king size storage under the bed plus a four drawer chest at the foot of the bed. Spot to mount a TV. And a thermostat to control your bedroom temperature while the thermostat for your main living area is out in the hallway. And there you go, that's a walkthrough of the Avalanche 295 RK, RK for rear kitchen. It's in stock now at Long Hall. Come to Lestowell and check it out.